Today, I'm going to be cooking stewed chicken with white rice. I love stewed chicken because one, I love gravy, and two, it's like the easiest thing I can cook with gravy because we know the oxtail and stewed peas and cow foot and all that have a lot of gravy too, but it's not fast like stewed chicken or curry chicken. But today, I can't do it with a curry on my teeth, so I'm just gonna do it with some stewed chicken. And I love food with a lot of ketchup and a lot of pepper. And with stewed chicken, I can have that both. So, stewed chicken is my specialty today. It's been a while since I've cooked rice in just a pot with the fire underneath it. Because normally, you know, modern days, we have rice cooker, so that's what I normally use now. So when I put the rice in the pot, I don't have to look back at it, but... We shall do it today! After years upon years since I, I did it the last time. Well, I am starting with my chicken. I cleaned it up just now. So I normally cut it up in really small pieces. So that's what I'm about to do right now and put on the browning and the Maggi season up. Chicken seasoning. Yeah. Can't eat chicken like this anymore. I don't know why, but it just half is small. I'm not really a person that loves to try new things, I'm afraid. Especially if I spend my money. <laughs> so, I'm about to season it and this is Maggi season up chicken season. I use the powder seasoning first, rub it up in it, in all the creases and inside the bones and stuff and stuff. I just like to make sure that everything is perfect and I cook with a lot of love. You know, when you're in love, you cannot rush. <laughs> Can't put too much brown in because you know so it will get bitter. So I time myself. Yeah, nah. Smell of seasoning. I love it. Time, love, love, love time. Rub it all in. I don't like a lot of time sticks though, so sometimes I do it like this. Take out the leaves itself. It's better. I like to cook with potatoes because when it's time for marinating, it gives the gravy a lot of body. So like a water can come out quicker. Add a little salt. Add a little butter. Right now we have your pan the pot for hot liquor more. Take out the water drops. Come on, I wanna add proper pan the kitchen. Burn up the camera and be at them something. Yeah. Smell good, Jesus. Woo. Want to sniff it? <laughs> I don't like to cook with a lot of oil either. Flush up the aisle of me, I take my time. I don't wait till the aisle normally extra hot. I wait till it practically warm because when it's too hot, it burn up the seasoning and all that and I don't like the taste of that, so. We're gonna add a little bit of water. I do it in the same pan because, you know, I add this with the chicken seasoning, huh? so it still have like a broth. Go and cook down like that. Right now, I'm gonna 
adding this. So by the time it's finished, then this should be as well. Nice, look like it's on its way. Well, that part, yes, cook. Oh, I like this rice. It tastes fluffy. Yeah, good. Yes, it's cook. <laughs> I'm very, <laughs> I'm very pleased. <laughs> right, let me see this one. So this one is bubbly. Gravy, gravy, good up, good up, gravy. This rice actually it is way better than when I cook it in rice cooker. Thank God. Very tasty. Very flavorful. Yes, I credit myself. Gravy is on point. Rice is soft. I'm gonna taste the, the Irish and carrot. I'm actually cook as well. So, enjoy. And thank you guys for letting me teach you how to cook stewed chicken the right way. <laughs> My way. <laughs> <laughs>